Hi, I'm Matthew Baker, author of Why Visit America, a strange and unique collection of stories. The title story of the collection is a story told in the form of a guidebook, but the collection itself is meant to serve as a guidebook, a guidebook to the United States. The collection contains 13 stories, one for every stripe in the American flag, and over the course of the book, Every state in the U.S. appears at least once, along with over a hundred major American cities, towns, monuments, and landmarks. And as readers make this epic journey across the American landscape, from the Everglades to the Great Lakes to the Appalachians to the Great Plains, readers are given a rich sampling of American culture, the astonishing foods, the spectacular holidays, the breathtaking fashions and music and amusements and sports. And yet, this isn't quite the U.S. that we know. While the book can be categorized as literary fiction, the book is also a work of speculative fiction, as each story in the collection is set in a different parallel universe, United States. The book opens with a seemingly traditional story in which the speculative element is extremely minimal. The narrator has a job that doesn't actually exist. A story that wouldn't seem that much out of place in a collection of literary realism. From there, the stories get progressively stranger and more blatantly sci-fi. And the book ends with a mind-bending experimental story set in a universe in which time moves backward, inverting the meaning of every choice and action a person makes, giving readers a way to reread every story in the book, upending the entire collection. Still, although these are stories set in alternate realities, ultimately this is a book about our reality. Read together, these parallel universe stories are meant to create a composite portrait of the real United States, a through-the-looking-glass reflection of who we are as a country. Why Visit America is a one-of-a-kind experience, but I never could have written it if not for the many stories that inspired and informed it. Uh, in particular, the anthropological sci-fi of Ursula K. Le Guin, uh, Kazuo Shiguro's novel Never Let Me Go, Margaret Atwood's novel The Handmaid's Tale, the movie Her, the video game Bioshock. There's the spirit of George Saunders in these stories, Borges, Calvino. And the most obvious comparisons, of course, are probably the Twilight Zone and Black Mirror. Anyway, that's the story of my book. It's a weird one, but I hope you like it.